Welcome to Bartow, Florida and Polk County. Folks out here are law abiding. They wouldn't be doing donuts in the middle of the road or nothing like that. Welcome to Polk County, one of the most law abiding places. Law abiding places you're ever going to see. There's a mountain over there. Right about. <laughs> There's a random snow capped mountain. Of, there it is. Yeah. It's like a snow capped mountain in There's Florida. There's another one over there. There's like a bunch of mountains of uranium infested water. Ain't even gators in those lakes. They're just dang mountains and stuff, man. Bartow, Florida. In Polk County, that's right. Adopt a litter free Polk County. Folks here in, in Polk County, they're they're country folks, they're patient. <laughs> These are very they're patient and law abiding folks here in Polk County. These folks are they're not in a rush to get anywhere out here. I want to go seven hours of the speed limit. It's a too. different it's a different it's a different type of life out here. Folks here they're very patient, law abiding and it's just reasonable folks really. Just law abiding folks in the abandoned railroad tracks. So we just drove into a utility pole over there. Dang right. Yeah, this ain't a crime infested place like the rest of America. These folks here, they're law abiding. These are law abating citizens out here. These folks, they're not in a rush. It's just a different speed of life here in Polk County. I know you folks are just thrilled about Polk County and all the great things happening here. You can get yourself a job out of a uranium mining facility, a fertilizer plant, more as environmental. Power plant. Nu nuclear power plant down there. Just great things happen here in Polk County. Yes, sir. Just different type of law abiding folks out here. This this is a very law abiding county. This is the third person is passing and I'm going well over the speed limit. No, nope, no, they wouldn't never do that. Don't lie like that. They wouldn't do bon donuts in the middle of the road either. These are law abiding folks out here, Catherine. Grady Pug got this whole place safe. Don't don't go around saying it's dangerous and, and folks are not abiding by the law out here. That that would be an outright lie. I would just be wrong to say something like that. These folks here are law abiding. These are law abiding people out here. No one guy can be everywhere. Well, you don't worry about that. He's got a whole team of them. It's just a great place. We're moving out here because he's doing a great job out here. Oh, no. <laughs> it's law abiding people, peaceful, patient people. We're almost to Bar. We're saying. almost to Bartow. And I think we're just gonna, as soon as we hit Bartow, start exploring this beautiful little town down there. In fact, the first street on the left is called Lakeside. We're just gonna roll right through there and see what type of folks are doing up there. Okay. Or you could wait for Clowder Street. Or you know what, we could just drive right through the town. Yeah, let's try to do the town. No, we're not doing that. We got several towns to go to today. We're gonna do Bartow, because it's a Polk County. Don't be rushing me. I'll tell you what to do. I'm going to tell you how you turn I'll tell you what to do. We're going to see the, the, there's a, a Wonder House here by the Publix. There's a Azelia Gardens. That sounds like a beautiful place down there. Red 2.6. See how far we are from Azelia Gardens down there. How to do it. How to do it. Even the vultures are dead. Of well, there's. It's not an environmentally free, In a quarter mile, friendly turn right practice. West Street. You know, mining is not exactly environmentally friendly. It looked like it had a heart attack in the middle of the well, air yeah, and then fell not, to the ground. It's not exactly the most environmentally sound thing to do, but if you want to be environmentally sound, you turn move. Right turn right, right, right there, right there, right there, right there, women. Right here. You. How many times I gotta tell you? If you want to be environmentally sound, you can move to California. We have great jobs in mining here. We have great jobs in mining. Okay, if you want to work for a high-paying tech company, you can move to California. Here in Florida, we got jobs in mining. We don't even have the advanced garbage trucks. We use real humans to pick up the garbage. We don't have those little 
electric arms and stuff like that. We're not, we're not going to get rid of a good job. This is what I like about Polk County. You see those guys right there? Most counties in Florida don't have humans hanging off the side of their trucks. They have those electric, you seen those electric arms? That's one machine that got rid of two good jobs. There's two good jobs right there that are being preserved. Right there, there's two good jobs right there. Look at that. Now most counties in Florida, they've already got rid of those two good jobs. They got some electrical claw machine that picks up the buckets. Well here, they just hang two guys off the side of a truck. Two more jobs right there created. Watch that pothole! Two good jobs created right there. Most counties in Florida, they've got rid of those two guys' job right there. They got some electrical claw that does it now. Why would you get rid of a good job? That's what I don't like about electronic automation. They're just getting rid of all the good jobs. There's Florida wildlife right there. There ain't too much wildlife left anyways around here. Nice. Look at that squad truck. You seen that GMC squad? <laughs> yeah, buddy. Did you see that squad truck? Ow! Don't put your hands on me. Do you see that squad of truck, honey? Yeah, buddy. I want y'all folks, when y'all see him in town, let him know that I like his squad of truck down there. This is just gorgeous out here. There's going to be a lot of memes about you today, Jose. This is just a gorgeous little area. The stop and save. I don't even know why they got metal bars in the windows. They don't even need it around here. That's how you know it's a safe neighborhood when a small neighborhood store has got to have metal bars and windows. It's just a, a, an extra safety procedure. Is that kid smoking? No. No, it wouldn't happen around here. It must have been like a straw or something. They got permatile roof on that house right there. That's called permatile. It's real gorgeous roofing. This is a nice little community here. It looks like Orlando type of building houses we're almost right outside what a gorgeous community i tell you this is just the type of place we ought to live we ought to live somewhere like this yeah. put a squatter truck on the driveway this actually does look nice it's a great little community you know it's safe because the corner store's got metal bars on the windows mm -hmm. that's just like an ins the insurance and there's lots of trees lots of trees too mm -hmm. lots of trees too that's a good place when you got a lot of trees. Lots of trees too. Look at this house right here. That's a great looking house right there. Made out of brick. They don't even make too many houses out of brick in Florida. Speed fines are double, Catherine. You're going to go slow down. You're already speeding. You don't want to do that. Great Joe will find you and lock you up. Find you a new husband at the Lee County Jail down there. Lee County Jail? This is a gorgeous neighborhood here. Just small town life down there. It's 15 miles per hour near these schools. Mm -hmm. This is a gorgeous little town. It's called Bartow. Let me hear you say it properly. Bartow. 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 800 feet. Turn left. This is just gorgeous right here. Look at these rolling hills. This is actually my accent. I spake like this. No, it doesn't. <laughs> turn left onto Dolor Bosque Avenue, then turn left onto South Hibiscus Drive. Turn left. Turn right? left right there. Look at that house. That is just gorgeous. Mm -hmm. You can tell he's a big way. I mean, that might be Grady Judge's house right there. I wouldn't even doubt that's Grady's house right there. That thing is just, that's a big way house right there. That might be Grady's place right there. Wouldn't even doubt it. Maybe one of his kin folks or something like that. This looks like Arcadia, but better. Right <laughs> Literally, it does. It's like Turn a better. Right Y'all keep going straight all the way to Georgia. Okay. It's like a better version of Arcadia. It really does. <laughs> it's like we're better than than Soto County down there. It looks more popular. I'll give you one. It looks it, it looks better than it looks better than Arcadia. I'll tell you that much. If there's one thing I I gotta be honest about, it definitely looks better than Arcadia. It's like if Arcadia paved their roads and took care of their houses. I like it. I really do like the style of the houses here. Would you get one, turn Jose? Right East I like Street. the style of the houses. They look really yeah. nice. I really do like This is like my favorite. Turn right. Turn right. Yes, ma'am. 
Look at this one, made out of brick. It's gorgeous. I it like re brick it really is. Yeah, look at that one right there, made out yeah. of brick. That's a gorgeous Continue house right there. Actually, I like this neighborhood here. Mm -hmm. Liver Realty. This is actually a pretty nice neighborhood. I like it. I wonder if all the neighborhoods in the entire city look like this. It's like a it's like a beautiful version of Arcadia. It's like if Arcadia didn't beat their wife, it would look like this. Bougainvillea. They had to throw in one of these modern houses and ruin the whole neighborhood's aesthetics with them stupid plastic fences down there. Yeah. They, they just probably a, lives they in ruined Oakland a great neighborhood. They really yeah. they ruined a great neighborhood with that house right there. Yeah. It was nice until we saw that that house yeah. ruin the whole neighborhood. What am I gonna do here? You're just gonna go straight ahead, honey. There's these apartments called Azalea Gardens. I've heard it's probably the best place in town to rent. Sounds like Wouldn't even doubt it. Mm -hmm. All right. This here's a, a great little town. Polk County's great, I'll tell you. You seen the sheriff down there? He goes, if I catch you breaking the law, I'm gonna lock you up and find your new husband. Probably lives in Winter Haven. <laughs> or Lake, Lake County or Lake County just commutes down here mm -hmm. probably lives down there in Lake County just commutes over here no probably lives in winter like celebration or something just like long commute down here down there in Claremont or uh, something just, he has to live in the county just, you know has a house up there has one here just just for his address and child support issues what <laughs> Now, don't discredit him. I can't you bring it along, my county boy. I don't even don't, know anything about that guy. I won't tear you a new one. You know? I won't sleep with your baby mama, too. Don't think we ain't gonna do that while you're locked up. You'll get locked up. That's my, just vulgar. He's a, bolder, he's a vulgar guy. He really is. But you're dealing with criminals. You just, you what gotta, the heck? Is this like Go women, drive the hand. Hand. Go women. You're dealing with criminals. You can't go soft on criminals. If they're vulgar, you gotta be vulgar. You're dealing with criminals, Catherine. You can't go soft on criminals. You, you gotta go tough on them. He sleeps with all their baby moms. You get locked up in Polk County, he'll send one of them brand new studs down there like, hey, honey, I just started with the sheriff's office. I heard your husband's locked up for not paying child support. Uh, honey, I got a full-time job at the sheriff's office. Well, I got a brand new Tahoe to fleet down there. You just want to pick you up and we'll head down there to Tahoe Place and have fly six or something like that. And you're locked up crying. <laughs> and he'll send you a photo, too. Like he, he's, Yeah, he's, he's slimy. He'll send you a photo of one of the sheriffs dating your, your, your baby mama down there. Like, while well, you was locked up. Here's what my officer Laird was doing. He took your baby mama down there to the Pancho place. That's her favorite place. In a well, now he's in going with her, and you're locked up with Larry up in here. He'll get you a new husband, and he'll get your baby mama a new husband. Everybody's getting a new husband in Polk County. You come out here to break the law. Where do I turn? You'll see a beautiful apartment complex on the right called Azalea. I heard it's one of the best places to rent in town. Mm -hmm. Oh, so he probably is been here. <laughs> These roads are a little unkept. Take a right here. Huh? Take a right right here. See, go to the right. I oh, can't. it's a one way. Okay, go around. You'll see the other entrance. Uh -huh. Okay, uh, right there. See the one way? Yeah. Right there. Just use a turn signal when mm -hmm. go right up in. This is. One of the best places to rent here in Polk County, from what I've heard. They got cameras just to make sure everybody's safe. <laughs> they got cameras right up there, make sure it's safe for everybody. Like, you know, you want to make sure everybody's Penny's safe. Golf View, Avenue. Golf View, look at that. Ow! In 1,000 feet, turn right onto Golf View Avenue. 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 Ow! You get locked up in Polk County. They visit the sheriff will visit your baby mama. 
That's how they keep their crime rate. It's very effective. That's why they don't even have crime problems here. Are they doing their laundry outside? What type of third world country is that? I don't know. Y'all to have a washer and dryer. It's the 21st century <laughs> down there in 20... Are we still in the 21st or 22nd now? 21st. We're still in the 21st century? I think so. They, they, they have made it. They got cameras. Look how many cameras they got. There's like 20 cameras up there. And how many cameras do you need? Make sure everybody's safe down there. Not gonna lie, I kind of like the way these projects look. How many cameras do you need? Down there, it's just got 20, Turn right onto golf 30 Avenue, cameras. I'm right like a whole pot tank little camera. They got 20, 30 cameras in this neighborhood down there. Anything happens here, they've seen it. They don't even need a snitch around here. You can just look at the cameras down there. I tell you what, that's a very secure neighborhood right there. I think homie's got to go, he got to go walk across the street to slam yeah, crack. Go to the right, now. go to the right. Right, okay. Homie had to walk all the way across and he had to go stand in front of the school to slam. You can't, you can't even slam up in there. <laughs> he had to walk all the way over here to get some product off of the thing. Just top cam Look at how many cameras they got up in that mode. Came and slinging pace in there, man. Turn right onto Bay Street, then your destination. Right in there, baby. These apartments here, they, they're rated. Oh, they're not too highly rated. Go right in here, honey. Go right in here. What's it say here? Don't hit the car while you're in the truck now. So that doesn't really matter. No soliciting, yeah. dumping, or walking dogs. You can't walk a dog. That's like the whole opposite theme of where we live in Lakewood Ranch. Where we live, it's like walk your dog all day. No trespassing. <laughs> they rated two point. What are they rated? Two point six. Two point. That's pretty low right there. Yeah. That's a pretty low rating for an apartment. Con. They're not a lot of walk. That's how you know it's a bad neighborhood. Yeah. If it's a good neighborhood, people are walking dogs. If yeah. you're not walking a dog, there's something wrong with you. Mm -hmm. Just, wow, this looks like, get me out of here. Yeah. I think there's a street that goes. Uh, Your destination is on the left. If I recall, there's a street you can drive right through the apartment complex. Ow! How many speed bumps do you need? Ow! I just had a medical procedure done, so this is kind of painful. <laughs> wow. I remember this road used to come out the back if I, last time we were in here. Mm -hmm. Ow! I'm not going to tell you why my friend lives in here. I'm not going to tell you what he does for a living. Oh, it's closed. Okay, we well, just do the loop right here and get out. Do that loop loop. Loop loop. They even have a speed bump in front of the loop a loop. Yeah. yeah. That don't even make any sense. Dude, my back feels like it's going to come off my spine right about now. They got a ballpark down there. Be a great place to metal detect. Why do they need metal bars around the around the laundry room? Somebody gonna steal the washing machine? I know Polk Town is better than that. Good country folks out here. Ow! Dang it, women! Well, at least slow down for it. Ah. <laughs> notice to visitors. It's like a, a notice to visitors. They have cameras on all these buildings, too. Look at that. My goodness. How many cameras do you need? This is a very safe community because of all the cameras. <laughs> Dang it, women. No, that's speed hump. Ah. Are get, you done? Get out. <laughs> that one hurt the most. You're gonna dislocate my spine, women. Just slow down a little bit for him. Yeah, buddy, got that quad. Ow. How many speed humps do they need out here? My goodness, this is a dumb ow. <laughs> I'm up to see a chiropractor after this. Look at the house across the street. They got metal bars on them. Is that metal bars in the windows? Yep. Why would you need? I don't even understand why you need something like that. And they that. got the hot shape in it too. Aww. That's nice. It sure is. I don't even understand why you'd have metal bars and cameras. You don't need none of that stuff if it's safe. I'd figure if it's a safe community, you wouldn't even need it. Somebody told me to check out the Azalea Gardens if we moved here. So if you moved here, you should check out Azalea we Gardens. We did. Take a left on Magnolia right here without speed hump down there. 
My back is dislocated. I don't even know what the crap I'm supposed to do here. Oh. Or how about well, one more block up to MLK? How about that? That's even better. That's a stop sign. I have to stop here in yes, the way. We'll take MLK right across town. You want to take a right or a left here, love? They painted the house green. Mm -hmm. John Deere a green. A right right or a left? Go left, women. They usually say Martin Luther King's supposed to be the worst road in every town, but I'm pretty sure that Isaiah Garden is worse than this. Mm -hmm. Look at the new house going in. Pretty house right there. Mm -hmm. Alright, we're on Martin Luther King. They uh, forgot to mow the sidewalk. They had grass going on the sidewalk here. That's just wrong. Mm -hmm. Look, they don't even mow the grass. It's just like grass yeah. growing on the road. Metal bars. That one got metal bars on everything on that one right there. Metal bars keep me safe from the people outside my home in Polk County. On the other side of the railroad track. Oh, my back is killing me. Let's see their downtown. You want to see their downtown? Just keep driving straight. We'll be there soon. <clears throat> Not a bad looking town overall. No. You don't have to hit that car. No, wow, I dude. I'm already enough pain and your driving sucks. Well, you have the accident of driving. <sighs> no, I'm not going to get the body You have the option of driving. You have the option of driving safely. How about that? How about you learn? I did. You have the option to drive safely. I did. Mm. Why'd you put this thing in here? You know I'm out of the city. It belongs here. Uh. This is the designated place for it. You put it here, it looks messy. Not record. Bartow with the Arto. It's just south of Lakeland. Just keep going straight ahead. Mm -hmm. And where it ends, we'll take a right. Mm -hmm. This is kind of neat right here. Yeah. Oh snap. Oh snap. Look at the little boss wagon beetle thingy. Why is this happening on a Monday? You should not have a hangout spot on a Monday. Weekends only. Monday is a work day. I bet there's a... Why is there a sign for a funeral home in front of a kid's park? That's pretty depressing. <laughs> That's like the most depressing thing you've ever seen. I like how their MLK's pretty nice. Nice, like a nice little area here. Trying to get good the sidewalks recently. At least on this side, the other side looks pretty crappy, but this one here looks pretty nice. I've never seen a Volkswagen Beetle in the hood. That's that's a first right there. Left or right? All right. Maybe in California. They're more popular in California. The nice thing about a truck is I don't have to worry about you hitting the curb. Did I hit the curb? No, I did not. But I hit some speed. I bet this town looks like it have like the most bomb barbecue ever, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay, hey, we get to Main Street, you'll take a left. Yeah. Okay. Right, right through Bar Tire. I like the people here, though. Real nice people from what I've seen in the past. <laughs> Seems like real good country people. Good people. 
Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Look at that truck right there. It's stretched. You're going to have to curb, man. Yeah, it's not bird. Look at the squatter truck in the car wash. Nice. Yeah, buddy. That's not squatter. That That's not That's not cool. It's bad when I know the definition of You're supposed squatting. to turn left. Yes, you do it here. Well, you can do it over there, but you're slower than a mug up in the joint. Now you... Wow. Ow! Good for you. Dude, what are you doing? Yeah, there's a car coming. Do it quickly, 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 quickly. Why do you drive like a crack? Huh? Why do you drive so bad? <laughs> I don't know. Dude, it's not funny, man. There was an actual turning lane to go left. Slow down. The ready judge gonna come get you. You need to stop burning. He's gonna bring me a baby, a brand new. He's gonna lock you up and bring me a new wife. No. He's gonna lock you up. Ready judge gonna lock you up for driving bad. He's so burning. And bring me a, a more fertile young wife. And while you're locked up, he's gonna Facetime you like, "Hey, Kay, look at Jose's new wife. She's more fertile, healthier, and she's not a criminal like you." Ready Joe gonna lock you up. Keep driving like that. He's gonna get you. There's a rest Cuban place right here downtown. Remember? Not sure why you came to a full stop either. You wonder why people road rage you? This is like the perfect American town right here. This is like the perfect small town. Women are all kind of showy, but other than that, it can't be perfect, okay? This is like the perfect small town in America. Squatted trucks driving around. Bail bond right there. There's another bail. Why does a small town need so many bail bondsmen? Squatted trucks and bail bondsmen. Two most prosperous businesses in towns are a suspension shop and a bailsman. This is America. Squatted jacked up trucks everywhere. You're driving. Why are you, why are you mad? <laughs> I'm not gonna lock you up. We're driving bad. Don't hit me. Don't don't hit me. They got cameras everywhere in this town. Put your hands on them. When you're not gonna lock you up. Go win. Take a right. A broadward. Broadward. Broadway. Broadwurst. Take a right on Brad, Bratwurst. Broadway. Bratwurst. Is that Mexican restaurant we ate at last time? Yes, we did. I wanted to go to the Cuban restaurant next to it, but it was closed. Did they close the Cuban restaurant? Yeah. Really? That sucks. Mm -hmm. Is that another squatted truck? Do you know, do you know squatted down there? Okay, take a ride on Bratwurst. 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 Squeeze your little fat jelly room. Ah, there's cameras. There's cameras. Not sure why you didn't go when you could have like a hundred times. One thing you learn about people in Polk County case, they're not very patient. Got all day, really. Go on, women. Going with single boy. Ow! Dude! Yeah, I'm going to die in a car accident the way you're driving. Easy. Why are you driving so aggressively, dude? You don't like it. You have the opportunity to do that. I'm going to get out right now. I'm just going to... How do you open this door? I'm going to get out and walk out so I can be safe, man. I'm serious, dude. I ain't going to die like this. You can either be quiet or you can drive yourself. Why don't we check out this gorgeous little town called Juan Juanetta? Is it in Polk County? Head north on North Broadway Avenue toward East Church Street. It's like a beautiful little town called Juanetta. What county is it in? Polk County. Cool. We're going to head out there. Let's go and check it out. It's a beautiful little town called Juanetta. Mm -hmm. How far do I stay out of the fog? When you get to uh, Highway 60, turn right onto US 98 South. 98 Highway 60, take a right. Uh, this transmission is suffering, bro. I don't know how many times you're going to clunk it back in between gears. You 
have the opportunity to drive if you want to complete. I'm gonna, I'm gonna write a, a letter to Grady Judd about your driving through his town. He's, I'm not. He's not gonna let you do, do drive like tourist town. You have the option of driving. You chose. You have the option to learn how to drive properly. How about that? You have the option to either be quiet. You have or the drive. option to learn how to drive. You have driven the option. halfway across America by now on this YouTube channel. Should have learned by now. You have had the option to drive or be quiet. You have the option. You chose. Grady Judge gonna lock you up for driving bad. In half a mile, use the right two lanes to turn right onto Florida 60 East, East State Road 60 East. Signs for Lake Wales, Vero Beach. Oh snap, look at that semi. That was pretty cool. Well, there's gonna be a lot of industry out here. Yeah. Although they had a CVS go out of business. <laughs> CVS went out of business. Well, they're not selling contraceptives around here. These folks wouldn't do nothing like that. Yeah. Well, we'll be here a while. We don't have contraceptives or contraceptives. We just don't do that around here. Buddy. Well, good luck, everybody. Okay. Fire below. Which part is my 98 north or south? I almost still got a sleeping bag. You're going uh, on 60. Okay, so I'm good. Okay. Yeah, buddy, got that 2500 right there. I'm in writing. Small town America wouldn't have <gasps> homeless. You want to get punched? For what? <laughs> like I was saying, small town America shouldn't have a bunch of homeless people going around. I, that's just a guy that looks like he's homeless. He's not really homeless. I know he kind of looked like a homeless guy with that sleeping bag. He was probably camping or something. Because a small town in Florida wouldn't have homeless people on their main streets like that. There! Horrendous traffic for a small town. I'll tell you what. <laughs> I'm just stuck in traffic down there. I don't know if he was a nice little place called Juanetta. I heard it's real nice country folks out there. Eight six trade all. Hey dog, what is who this guy hating on my hood dog? Hey, you don't know nothing about my hood dog. Poke elections down there. <laughs> Just saying down there. What really matters in a small town? We don't have crime, lawlessness, or homelessness here. Or traffic congestion. That's all in big cities. This is like a small town with big city problems. I'm just going to go in and say it. We live in brains when we don't have traffic like this. I know. And there's like no reason for it either. Small, yeah, right. It's like no freaking nowhere. Small town with big city problems. You're gonna go. The Aldi did traffic tra traffic supplies all in one store. You go to Aldi. Yeah, and that's 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 a good observation, Kate. Yeah. <laughs> Across the street from the Chick Fil A, loads. You uh, that's a that's a solid observation. Ow, that cramp. <laughs> I'm sure these folks are up to good things. Oh yeah. Just white, the whites and the blacks working together for good purposes. Down there. Airboat. 
Air boat swampy dumpy. Ah, I feel good. Diamond in the back. Why this guy skateboarding. Why is he skateboarding up a hill? Oh, it's a homeless camp entrance. Cool. Yeah. Cool. Look, there's a homeless camp back there. Yeah, there's a homeless camp back there. You see that? Yeah, that's not. I feel like having a homeless camp right in the geographical heart of your city. And a uh, homeless person with a mini skateboard. Yeah, there's like a homeless camp back in there. Yeah. The, the youth here is really going places. You can just oh, yeah. tell. You can see when you see the young people here, you just know they're they're on the right path. They're on the narrow path to prison. Flamingo dive. Oh, there's some new construction going on here. Oh, yeah. Maybe it'll be another Publix. Probably. Don't get it. A Publix, a dental care, a car wash, and a shine walk. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And a shine walk. Oh, well, we're crossing the Peace River. Yeah, you're about to ram right into it. I had saved some homeless camps out here if you want to go to them. No. You don't want to go inside homeless camp? Nope. They look great for our channel. Nope. Well, that's bar tow for you. If you're thinking about moving here, you might want to start getting your truck squatted already. Yeah. Castrate your shoulder in and squat your truck and come on down. Dream pregnancy heat right here is to the roof. We don't need more problems. If you're coming here, don't bring your problems with you. Black tear. I like a farm supply. Big tear, I like a farm supply. How many farm supplies does a small town need? Taco stand. A Patriots fan. Oh no. Get the crap out of here. We're done. It's over. We're done. I'm, I'm not going to record this crap. Oh, there's 